good reason to come to the Smith School is to learn the models and formulas from people who invented them. I've done some of the original research and options, and I've also worked in industry applying them at Goldman Sachs. I think it's good to take a class from a professor who understands the models and their historical development as well as their application and shows you why they're good and why they're bad and when to use them. When I started my graduate work, the Black-Scholes formula, which won a Nobel Prize, was only a few years old. And it had not been tested extensively. So the, an option formula is a formula for the value of an option, which gives you the right to buy or sell stock or buy or sell foreign currency. And the Black-Scholes formula assumes that uh, the risk of a stock is constant, so you get a normal distribution. When you look at the stock market or when you look at currency markets, uh, they don't follow a normal distribution and the risk is not constant. And I was able to discover or invent a new way of solving for options so that I could solve with stochastic volatility and uh, I published that in 93 and uh, developed extensions of it. And uh, there's even a Wikipedia article where you can read the basics. So if you have questions about option models, I'll be teaching about currency options next semester. If you have questions about mutual funds, my colleague Russ Wormers uh, did the original research. He'll be in the classroom. And if you have questions about microstructure and how stocks are traded and how information gets into stocks, my colleague Pete Kyle will be there too. So you can learn from the source instead of learning from people who learned it from textbooks. I hope the students will learn about financial models and how to use them. You know, sometimes you don't have to know all the details of a specific model, but you just have to know that the model exists. When I was a master's student, I didn't even know what options were or know that there were formulas for options. And then I learned some basic formulas and as I thought about them, I realized that these formulas had limitations, but they were very useful. And they're like tools. The problem is, if the only tool you have is a hammer, every problem looks like a nail. And we offer more tools in finance and in other areas. Another reason to come here is we'll teach you the latest research, which is not in textbooks. So we won't always tell you the, the formulas and techniques that are being used in industry today. We'll teach you the techniques that are going to be used in industry in 10 or 20 years. Mm -hmm.